Chelsea won their first competitive match under coach Mauricio Pochettino with a 3-0 home victory over Premier League new boys Luton Town on Friday thanks to two goals by Raheem Sterling and Nicholas Jackson's first strike for the Londoners. Sterling received the ball from wing-back Malo Gusto, cut in from the right and weaved his way through Luton's defence before shooting low into the far corner in the 17th minute for one of his best goals in a Chelsea shirt. The duo combined again in the 68th when Gusto ran onto a pass from British record transfer signing Moses Caicedo. Seven minutes later, Sterling turned provider as he crossed for Jackson and the Senegal striker stretched out a boot to score his first Chelsea goal since signing from Villarreal in June. It was the big spending Blues' first win of the season after an opening day 1-1 draw against Liverpool and last Sunday's 3-1 defeat at West Ham United and only their second win in 15 Premier League games including last season's dreadful run. Luton, playing just their second top division game in 31 years, after opening with a 4-1 defeat at Brighton and Hove Albion, and with a side assembled largely from players out of the lower divisions, spurned a chance to level on the hour. Ryan Giles had the goal at his mercy but Gusto half blocked his shot and keeper Robert Sanchez reached for the looping ball. The home fans responded enthusiastically as Chelsea recorded their first home league win since March 4 and Pochettino lived up to his promise to get the Blues playing attractive football after the struggles of last season under Thomas Tuchel and Graham Potter, both of whom were fired. Sterling has flourished under the Argentine having struggled to find consistent form for much of the time since his move from Manchester City in July last year. I had a conversation with the gaffer earlier last week and we've gone through the role and I know exactly what he needs from me and it's as simple as that, Sterling said. I came in a difficult period, that's all finished, he added. I think the most important thing, I've had a look at myself and I'm a person who always tries to analyze what I've been doing, what I've done wrong, what I can change. In a less spectacular way, Friday's win was also significant for the way Caicedo slotted into the anchor role in Chelsea's midfield, allowing Enzo Fernandez and Conor Gallagher to venture further forward and Tretch Luton who were outclassed.